looks like Armucci, Mochi. but there's an R there that doesn't okay. exist. Okay. Armucci. So how do you think I say her first name? I just always call her Armucci. Jackie Ellen Jane. Say it again. Jackie. Jackie. Jackie.
front on each side if anybody wants them. Right over there, plenty of seats. For those of you who have just walked into the chapel, there are still plenty of seats up front on the sides.
Good afternoon. Good afternoon. On behalf of the upper school faculty, I would like to welcome our students, parents, and special guests to this year's Honors Day. I would like us as a community to observe a moment of silence for, this, this mor for the victims of this morning's tragedy at Santa Fe High School in Texas. Thank you. Today's awards presentation is designed to recognize our most distinguished students and faculty from all areas of school life. It would be impossible for us to recognize each and every achievement of our student body at today's event. However, everyone seated here today should be proud of their accomplishments in the classrooms, on the playing fields and stage, and for the service they have provided to our community. Faculty and families, please join me in honoring the achievements of all of our students this year with a round of applause. <laughs> Honors Day is designed to reflect the mission of Darlington School. Today's awards recipients epitomize learning with passion, acting with integrity, and serving with respect. We will now begin the presentation of awards with our Dean of College Guidance, Mr. Sam Moss. Appropriately, we will begin today's ceremony by recognizing 89 of our seniors who have been offered 196 merit scholarships by many different colleges throughout the country for their academic, artistic, athletic merit and achievement. These scholarship offers have totaled $10.8 million in value, and that does not include the HOPE Scholarship Grant. These scholarships have already been announced in the assemblies and in Lakeside Lines throughout the year as they were received, but I would now ask those 80 seniors to please stand as a group and receive our recognition. Seniors. All of us at Darlington are very proud of those seniors who have earned those scholarships, and we will now begin the awards. The Edward Nixon McKay Memorial Scholarship. These $1,000 college scholarships were established in a trust fund by the late Lucia N. McKay to provide college tuition for worthy students. We have four recipients this year, and I would ask them to come forward and receive your applause as a group. This year's recipients of the Edward Nixon McKay Memorial Scholarships, Jamark Malik Taj Walters, Johns Creek, Georgia, Julia Dare Holmes, Rome, Georgia, Catherine Grace Chisholm, Somerville, Georgia, and Brianne Grayson Bishop, Rome, Georgia. Congratulations. <laughs> The Williamson Prize. This $2,000 scholarship is given by Douglas F. Williamson, Jr., Darlington Class of 48, in memory of his parents and in honor of his 50th Darlington reunion, in the hopes of encouraging attendance at Amherst College or other New England private colleges and universities by Darlington students, and particularly Darlington men from the Deep South. This year's recipient of the Williamson Prize is Jamark Malik, Malik Taj Walters, Johns Creek, Georgia. The Julia Quigg Dodd Memorial Scholarship and the Charlotte Reichel Memorial Scholarship are given by the National Creative Society in recognition of creative excellence to two seniors with plans to pursue a degree in the creative or fine arts. 
The Julia Quigg Dodd Memorial Scholarship goes to Harris Daniel Peak, Rome, Georgia. And the Charlotte Reichel Memorial Scholarship goes to Alan Patrick Shorey, Rome, Georgia. The Phi Beta Kappa Book Award. Founded in 1776, Phi Beta Kappa is the oldest and most prestigious of the National Honor Academic Societies in the United States. This award is presented by the Phi Beta Kappa Society of Georgia to a Darlington student who exemplifies the highest level of academic, ethical, and social commitment reflective of the principles of Phi Beta Kappa. This year's recipient is Jackson Connor Ely, Rome, Georgia. The Harvard Club Award. The Harvard Club of Georgia sponsors this award to honor an outstanding junior at Darlington who has demonstrated both intellectual and personal promise through scholarship, character, and achievement in other non-academic fields. This year's recipient is Xuan Zenith Han, Beijing, China. The Yale Book Award, sponsored by the Yale Club of Georgia and given to a junior who has exhibited outstanding character and intellectual promise, excellence in non-academic pursuits, exceptional leadership skills, and noteworthy contributions to the community. This year's recipient of the Yale Award is Jaki Ellen Zhang, Jinan, China. The Swanee Club Award for Excellence. The Swanee Club Award is presented by the University of the South to a member of the junior class who has demonstrated excellence in writing and the promise of continued outstanding writing achievement in the future. The student chosen should also demonstrate academic scholarship, leadership, and involvement in the school community. This year's recipient is Natalie Faith Hora, U Harley, Georgia. The Wellesley College Book Award. The Atlanta Wellesley Club sponsors this award to honor a female student in the junior class who has an exceptional academic record and has made a significant personal contribution to her school or community. This year's recipient is Rebecca Zhang, Shanghai, China.
Class scholarship awards are presented to those undergraduates who have the highest average at each level. The senior award will be presented at graduation. This year's recipient for the ninth grade is Cooper Efton Cates, Rome, Georgia. Our 10th grade recipient is Trang Min Dang, Adairsville, Georgia. The 11th grade recipient is Jackson Connor Eady, Rome, Georgia. The Hanks Medal for Scholarship, named for J. Daniel Hanks Sr., Darlington Class of 1927. The Hanks Medal for Scholarship is presented to the student with the highest average in grades nine through 12. This year's recipient, Stacy Chen, Rome, Georgia. Paul J. King R.M. Yankee Award for Excellence in Mathematics. This award is given in memory of the late Paul J. King and R.M. Yankee in recognition of their profound influence upon the lives of the students and in particular upon the lives of the donors, the late Robert, class of 49, and G. Ogden Persons, class of 53. This annual award is made to that student who has demonstrated excellence in mathematics. This year's recipient is Sophia Kalusche, Bad Homburg, Germany. The Rensselaer Medal. The Rensselaer Medal was established by Rensselaer Polytechnical Institute in order to recognize superlative academic achievement and to promote careers in science, engineering, and technology. It is awarded to a promising junior who has distinguished themselves in mathematics and science. This year's recipient is Zhao Chen Jonathan Zhang, Beijing, China. The John Rood Cunningham Jr. Award, established in memory of the late John Rood Cunningham Jr., who was a member of the Darlington community for more than 30 years. This award is presented to that student of physics who, in the judgment of the science department, is most deserving. This year's recipient is Wee David Wu, Dalian, China. The Everett E. Porter Award for Excellence in Chemistry Laboratory. The Everett E. Porter Award was established by Mr. Charles A. Height of Rome, Georgia, in memory of Dr. Everett E. Porter. This award recognizes excellence in laboratory work in chemistry. This year's recipient is Zichi Rebecca Zhang.
the A.J. Huffman Memorial Award. Established by the classmates and friends of the late Butch Huffman, class of 1967, this award is given to that student in chemistry who has demonstrated the highest achievement in this course. This year's recipient is Trang Min Dang, Adairsville, Georgia. The George A. Dorsey Award. This award is given in loving remembrance of George Andrew Dorsey, a longtime teacher whose example of gentleness and concern deeply influenced decades of Darlington students and faculty. It recognizes that student who is distinguished by their quest for knowledge and their love for living things. This year's recipient is Catherine Grace Chisholm, Somerville, Georgia. The Jeffrey M. Horsfield Scroll. This award is presented to the senior honor student whose interest, keen insight, and high performance have caused this student to excel in the field of history. This year's recipient is Abigail Elizabeth Sklar, Rome, Georgia. The DAR Medal for American History, the Xavier Chapter, National Society of Daughters of the American Revolution, recognizes a student demonstrating excellence and outstanding work in the study of American history. This year's recipient is Andrew Stanley Brunt, Cartersville, Georgia. The Global Scholars Awards. Nine Darlington students have successfully completed the Global Studies program for 2017-2018. A global scholar is one that has acquired a deep understanding of world issues from different perspectives, developed empathy, and a sense of their own role as global citizens. It is with great pleasure that I present these nine students, now equipped to make significant contributions to the global community. Emily Grace Edwards. Rome, Georgia. I'll go through the rest of them and then we'll applause at the end. Mary Anna Fricks, Rome, Georgia. Adrian Lars Martin Garvel, Helsingborg, Sweden. David Lawson Hagler, Rome, Georgia. Ansley Claire McCoy, Kennesaw, Georgia. Annabelle Grace Scarborough, Hickory, North Carolina. Rainey Camille Scarborough, Hickory, North Carolina. Randall Markham Smith, Jr., Rome, Georgia. And Lily Stott Washburn, Hickory, North Carolina. Register Award. <clears throat> this award is given in honor of E.V. Register to that student who has shown great interest in the study of English and has demonstrated excellence in both writing and the appreciation of literature. This year's recipient is Guangxi Peter Liu, Shanghai, China. The Rena Patton Award. The Rena Patton Award recognizes excellence or great promise in the area of creative writing by a Darlington student. The award is established in appreciation for the teaching and influence of Ms. Patton on Diane Allison Bellamy, class of 1990. This year's recipient is Lin Yun Catherine Gu, Shanghai, China. The 
the George W. Awesome Award. This award is given in honor of George W. Awesome, who gave the gift of pleasure in the arts to Darlington students for many years. It's presented to the junior who enjoys and excels in subject areas involving the humanities, history, English, foreign language, and the fine arts. This year's recipient is Margaret Lee Inman, Rome, Georgia. The George and Betsy Awesome Senior Art Collection. The George and Betsy Awesome Senior Art Collection was established to honor the finest senior artists and the studio art programs that guided them. Chosen by a jury selection, these works will be on permanent display at Darlington School. This year's artists are Mariana Fricks, Rome, Georgia, Camden Elise Hawkins, Rome, Georgia, Long Wen, Vietnam, Alan Patrick Shorey, Rome, Georgia. The American Choral Directors Association National Student Awards. The American Choral Directors Association National Student Awards are given to two outstanding seniors who have demonstrated a sincere love of music through the art of choral singing. This year's recipients are Caroline Cordell, Rome, Georgia, and Robert Munro, Cedartown, Georgia. The Darlington School Chorus Award, given by the Denny family in memory of Worth Moser and those students who have given their time and talents to a rich tradition of choral music at Darlington, the Darlington School Chorus Award is awarded to the senior student who has contributed the most to the Darlington Choral Department during their senior year. This year's recipient is Hilary Tunnell, Rome, Georgia. Chorus Darlington Players Achievement Awards are given for unselfish dedication and service to the Darlington Players and the Choral Department. This year's recipients are Stacy Chen, Rome, Georgia, and Long Win, Ho Chi Minh, Vietnam. The Darlington Players Awards are awarded for outstanding contribution in dramatic performance. This year's recipients are Brianne Grayson Bishop, Rome, Georgia, and Nolan Tyler Wilson, Rome, Georgia. The Darlington Players Award for Production is awarded for outstanding contribution in dramatic and technical production. This year's recipient is Jackie Ellen Zhang, Jinan, China. The McKimmy Wilkinson Passion Award is awarded to that freshman cast member who is not a lead, but rather a member of the ensemble who shows dedication, 
and passion to the production in which he or she has participated. This year's recipient is Owen Daniel Payne, Armerty, Georgia. The John Philip Sousa Award is given in recognition for outstanding achievement in interest in instrumental music, for singular merit in loyalty and cooperation, and for displaying those high qualities of conduct that school instrumental music requires. This year's recipient is Gabrielle Nicole Jones, Spartansburg, South Carolina. The McKimmy Wilkinson Percussion Scholarship is given annually in memory of Clay McKimmy and Sean Wilkinson. Sean and Clay were active percussionists in Darlington's former steel drum band. This award is given to two current percussionists who are members of either the band or the orchestra so that they may attend a music summer camp of their choosing. This year's recipients are Caleb Joseph Baldwin, Rome, Georgia, Andrew William Federer, Buford, Georgia. The D.M. McNall Awards, these awards are presented to those seniors who typify the best qualities of a scholar-athlete, have an overall average of 90 or better, and have lettered in at least two sports. This year's recipients are Stacy Chen, Rome, Georgia, Emily Grace Edwards, Rome, Georgia, Samuel James Tackleberry, Matthews, North Carolina. The C.J. Wyatt Senior Award, established in honor of Mr. C.J. Wyatt, former patron, friend, and trustee, and is awarded to the best male athlete in school. This year's recipient is Ty J. Lamar Watley, Rome, Georgia. The Joe Mull Memorial Award. This award was established by the late Dean Covington Sr. in memory of Joe Mull, an alumnus who lost his life in World War II. It is given to the most versatile male athlete in school. This year's recipient is Jacob Patrick Hunt, Rome, Georgia. The Most Outstanding Female Athlete Award. Established by the late Eve B. Register, this award is determined by a vote of the varsity coaches in all sports. This year's recipient is Callie Ann Maffitt, Rome, Georgia. The Most Versatile Female Athlete Award. The Most Versatile Female Athlete Award is determined by a vote of the varsity coaches in all sports. This year's recipient is Julia Dare Holmes, Rome, Georgia.
This award is given in memory of Anna Kipp and Hannah Tillman, class of 2007, who passed in the winter of their junior years and whose legacies have left a smile on the faces of everyone who knew them. Anna Kipp and Hannah Tillman were both bright young ladies who possessed bold personalities, infectious smiles, a willingness to always make time for friends and strangers alike, and most of all, great loyalty all of which earned them our love and respect. The recipient of this award is a junior girl that best exemplifies the characteristics of an athlete and an artist who demonstrates a love for life and a genuine acceptance of the people around her. This year's recipient is Morgan Lila Ivester, Tryon, Georgia. The Class Citizenship Awards. As chosen by the faculty, these awards are to be presented to the boy and girl in each class, both resident and day, who have proven to be overall friends to the school and, and the students by its loyalty, their kindness, attendance, allegiance, and other good citizenship attitudes. A total of 16 awards will be given, so please hold your applause until all the names have been called. This year's recipients are Ninth grade day girl, Ivy Cole Waters, Rome, Georgia. And ninth grade day boy, Knox Williamson Sermons, Rome, Georgia. Ninth grade residential girl, Leslie Grace Garlinghouse, Fayetteville, Arkansas. and ninth grade residential boy, Jonathan James Murphy, Fayetteville, North Carolina. Tenth, tenth grade day girl, Vika Marie Malinchuk, Rome, Georgia. 10th grade day boy, William Alexander Green, Rome, Georgia. 10th grade residential girl, Carissa Lee Brogdon, Nassau, Bahamas. And 10th grade residential boy, Alec Scott Peterson, South Bend, Indiana. Eleventh grade day girl, Amelia Grace Allen, Rome, Georgia. Eleventh grade day boy, Sloman Rhett McDermott, Rome, Georgia. Eleventh grade residential girl, Catherine Ann Chun, Jasper, Georgia. An 11th grade residential boy, Omar Mahar Hamad, Dahran, Saudi Arabia. Twelfth grade day girl, Bronwyn Sarah Luttweiler, Rome, Georgia. Twelfth grade day boy, John Campbell Jack Albertson, Rome, Georgia. 12th grade residential girl, Pat Chimnatanu, Lapuri, Thailand. 12th grade residential boy, Ethan Wesley Willie, Nassau, Bahamas. <laughs> Worth 
Moser Award. The Worth Moser Award was established by John McFarland, class of 63, and Johnny McFarland, class of 86, and is awarded to the senior who has demonstrated the greatest commitment to the Darlington motto, wisdom more than knowledge, service beyond self, honor above everything. This year's recipient is Sophia Kalusche, Bad Hamburg, Germany. The DAR Good Citizenship Award. The DAR Good Citizenship Award is sponsored by the Daughters of the American Revolution Xavier Chapter and given to that out outstanding student who is showing through leadership, honor, courage, patriotism, and unselfish selfish service those high standards necessary to be a responsible citizen. This year's recipient is Ashling Cares Fields, Cordial, Georgia. The Ray A. Kroc Youth Achievement Award. The Ray Kroc Youth Achievement Award was established in memory of Ray A. Kroc, founder of McDonald's Restaurants and a great believer in young people and their contributions to our society. McDonald's Ray Kroc Award recipient is an outstanding senior who has earned the respect of his or her teachers and peers through notable contributions to the school in the areas of citizenship, leadership, scholarship, sportsmanship, and to the community. This year's recipient is Samanda Westcott Cox, Rome, Georgia. George Eastman Young Leaders Award. Sponsored by the University of Rochester, this award is given to a member of the junior class who has shown strong leadership experience at school and in their community while maintaining high grades in challenging courses. This student also contributes a great deal of time to extracurricular activities. This year's recipient is Thomas Francis Atha Jr., Rome, Georgia. Frederick Douglass and Susan B. Anthony Award. Sponsored by the University of Rochester, this award is given to, the, to a member of the junior class who has shown outstanding achievement in the humanities and or social sciences and has a, has a demonstrated commitment to understanding and addressing difficult social issues. This year's recipient is John Ube, Lagos, Nigeria. The Morgan Sicily Love of Life Award. This award is given in memory of Morgan Sicily, who as a ninth grader left an indelible smile in the memory of the Darlington community because of her contagious love for living. The recipient of this award is a ninth grade resident girl who has demonstrated a zeal for life, a graciousness of spirit, and a generosity with laughter. This year's recipient is Tanya Elizabeth Maples from Hampton Cove, Alabama. The Bo Satterfield Spirit of Life Award. This award commemorates the life and spirit of Boyd G. Satterfield, who died on February 3, 1993. This award is not intended to recognize academic achievement alone, but more importantly, will also recognize a spirit and attitude and a capacity for living that reaches beyond the normal range of achievement or experience. This award celebrates the accomplishments and characteristics of a young person whose life reflects the highest ideals of our society. This year's recipient is Yeva Taraski Vishuti Yevos Marianopolis, Lithuania.
The Angelin Hollingsworth Johnson Memorial Awards are presented to the senior boy and girl who best exemplify Christian ideals and commitments. This year's recipients are Mary Ellison Brewster, Rome, Georgia, and Robert Pierce Monroe, Cedartown, Georgia. The Wesley N. Coleman Jr. Memorial Award is given to that senior boy and senior girl who combined outstanding scholastic achievement with outstanding school spirit. This year's recipients are Ashana Manesh Desai, Rome, Georgia, and John Franklin Druckenmiller, Rome, Georgia. The Godfrey Smith Family Award for General Excellence. Established by Godfrey and Patty Hill Smith of Tallahassee, Florida, in lasting appreciation for Darlington's profound influence on the lives of their sons, William Godfrey Smith, Jr., class of 1972, and Robert Hill Smith, class of 1978. This award is presented annually to a resident senior boy who through leadership, scholarship, and school spirit exi best exemplifies the traditions of Darlington. This year's recipient is Samuel James Tackberry, Matthews, North Carolina. The Coxwell Kerr Award. Established by Mr. and Mrs. Milton Coxwell of Monroeville, Alabama, in honor of Ann Rooney Kerr, Thornwood Class of 1965, and in recognition of her devoted participation in the Rome Parents Program, and in honor of their children, William John Nelson Coxwell, Class of 1998, and Clara Stewart Coxwell, Class of 2000, this award is given to that senior boarding student with at least three years in residence whose leadership, character, scholarship, and spiritual life best exemplify the aims and ideals of the boarding tradition of Darlington School. This year's recipient, Alexandra Graziella Gardner, Nassau, Bahamas. The John Glenn Awards, established by Mr. and Mrs. Jack Glenn in appreciation of the influence of Darlington School on their son, John Glenn, class of 1983. These awards are presented annually to that resident senior boy and girl who have shown the greatest improvement academically and socially in their experience at Darlington. They must have been resident students here for at least two years. This year's recipients are Morgan Linnell Adams, Freeport, Bahamas, David Daniel Markson, Lagos, Nigeria. RM Yankee Faculty Award for Excellence in Teaching. This award is given to honor Helen B. and Richard M. Yankee for 46 years of faithful service to Darlington School. The recipient is chosen to honor the faculty member who represents the ideals of scholarship, commitment, and dedication to young people both in and out of the classroom. This year's recipient is Brian Inman.
the Parents' Choice Award. Established in 2001 by the Darlington Parents Association, the Parents' Choice Award is selected from parent nominations and awarded to a distinguished member of the faculty and staff who has shown significant commitment to the school, its mission, and its students. The recipient of this award has served the school for at least five years, possesses great skill and leadership ability, demonstrates a commitment to the Darlington motto, is a faithful member of the Darlington community, and epitomizes its cooperative spirit. One of the, nominee, one of the nominators for this um, award said that this faculty member exhibits the Darlington motto and is constantly connecting individually to each one of their student, students. The Upper School Tiger Pride is pleased to announce this year's award to Chad Woods. has a significant contribution to the Darlington Community Award. We desire to honor a teacher who excels in enthusiasm, participation, and leadership to help make Darlington School a better place for us all. The Upper School Tiger Pride is pleased to present this year's award to Mr. Eddie Guth. In teaching award. The Upper School Tiger Pride wishes to recognize and honor the faculty by presenting the Excellence in Teaching Award to a teacher who has demonstrated excellence in the classroom, teaching by expecting and encouraging excellence in students. The Upper School Tiger Pride is pleased to present this award to Melissa Smiley. Lauren, please don't go anywhere. <laughs> Lauren, I, I want to thank you for being our Tiger Pride president these last two years. And on behalf of the upper school faculty and students, please accept this gift as a, a token of our appreciation. The William Gordon Neville Jr. Student Council Faculty Award. This award is presented by the Student Council to that faculty member who has demonstrated exceptional dedication, service, and assistance to the Darlington School student body. This year's recipient is Mrs. Julia Dodd. Rhonda F. Mixon Award. Established by the student leaders she inspired, the Rhonda F. Mixon Award honors that senior student council member who embodies the enthusiasm, dedication, and love of Darlington School that Rhonda Mixon brought to our student council during her many years of service as its advisor. This year's recipient is Randall Markham Smith, Jr., Rome, Georgia. Charles Scott Award. Established by the 1967 Intramural Champions to honor the memory of the late Charles Scott, the award is continued by the family of Charles A. Height, class of 32. The Charles Scott Award is awarded to that boarding senior who, through the course of the year, has shown the greatest concern for, interest in, and consideration of fellow students. Students. The recipient is selected by the votes of the senior class officers and the senior members of the Honor Council and the White Cabinet. This year's recipient is Oluwadara Elizabeth Shodapo, Abuja, Nigeria.
Sydenham Howell Award was established by Dr. Albert Sidney Johnson from Charlotte, North Carolina, and continued by the Y Cabinet. A Bible is awarded to that senior, other than an officer of the Y Cabinet, who has contributed most to the spiritual life of the school during the academic year. This year's recipient is Callie Ann Maffitt, Rome, Georgia. The Barbara Ware Book Award is presented to that senior who through scholarship and service has demonstrated an outstanding commitment to a future of harmony, justice, and opportunity for all people. This year's recipient is Alexis Monte Lutgert, Naples, Florida. The St. Lawrence University Book Award. In recognition of the value placed on service to others, St. Lawrence University presents this award to honor the achievements of a, ju a junior who has displayed a significant commitment to community service. This year's recipient is Marissa Joan Joseph, Ackworth, Georgia. Rhodes College Book Award is presented to a 10th grader who has demonstrated exemplary community service efforts in addition to maintaining a superlative academic standing. This year's recipient is Abigail Grace Yerke, Rome, Georgia. Darlington School Community Service Award is given to honor a senior for volunteer community service. This year's recipient is Lily Stott Washburn, Hickory, North Carolina. The Darlington School Jabberwock Award. This year's Jabberwock Award honors the staff member who has made the greatest contribution to the yearbook. This year's recipient is Claire Fleming Anderson, Rome, Georgia. The Darlingtonian Award. The Darlingtonian Award is presented to the student who, in the opinion of the advisor to the Darlingtonian, has been the most valuable to the publication. This year's recipient is Abigail Elizabeth Sklar, Rome, Georgia. Darlington School Inkslinger Award. The Inkslinger Award is presented to the student who has made the most valuable contribution to the publication of the literary magazine, both in dedication and achievement. This year's recipient is Amanda Caroline Temples, Cartersville, Georgia. The Alice Cooper Griffin Memorial School Service Awards are presented to the senior girl and boy who have shown the greatest service and loyalty to the school, but have not been recognized by election or appointment to a high office. This year's recipients are Hillary Ann Tennell, Rome, Georgia, Byron William Bisco III, St. Thomas, U.S. Virgin Islands. The Walker Smith Awards for unselfish service are awarded to those seniors who have made the most unselfish contribution of their time and effort to the life of Darlington School. This year's recipients are Julia Dare Holmes, Rome, Georgia, Randall Smith Jr., Rome, Georgia.
the Darlington School Discipline Committee Award. Being president of the discipline committee is one of the most difficult leadership positions for students at Darlington. They are expected to lead eight other students and four members of the faculty in holding students to a high standard of behavior. Lily has been both a strong and caring leader for the committee and how she has made sure that the main focus of the DC was to put students in a position to learn from their trans transgressions while protecting the mission of Darlington. Her belief in what Darlington can do for students and her desire to keep Darlington a refuge for all were evident in each and every meeting. We will miss Lily's experience and guidance, but we hope that those who saw her, saw her lead, will continue her legacy of appreciation for Darlington and its students. This award goes to the president, Lily Washburn. the Darlington Honor Council Award. The ability to connect with one's peers is a distinctive attribute of a natural leader. Add to that an exceptional character, setting the example for integrity for fellow students. Just such a young man has guided the council to respectful and thoughtful consideration of each case this year. The 2018 recipient of the Honor Council Award is Samuel James Tackaberry, Matthews, North Carolina. The Y Cabinet, Darlington's student-led religious life organization, has been blessed this year to be guided by a young woman of great Christian faith leadership and a heart for others. She took on the presidency of the Y Cabinet with a true seriousness of purpose. I am so grateful to her for her partnership, support, kindness, patience, and unfailingly positive attitude. Her leadership has set a high standard for others to follow in years to come. This award goes to our president, Mary Ellison Brewster, Rome, Georgia. The Student Council was created so students could have meaningful discussions about the institution and have a platform to meet with the administration to discuss the direction of the school. This year, the Student Council has done a tremendous job of giving the student body a voice and improving the student experience. Darlington and I are grateful for the effort and hard work put in by this year's student body president, David Lawson Hagler, Rome, Georgia. The Centennial Cup presentation. The Centennial Cup is an award given annually to a well-deserving house that has set itself apart in various aspects of school life. Houses are awarded points for the Centennial Cup activities, including academic standing, rumpus, and community service hours. This year's winner epitomized the standards of excellence that the Darlington House System represents. Through leadership, scholarship, and fellowship, this house has excelled as this year's Centennial Cup Award winner. It is my honor to present this year's Centennial Cup to the prefects and head of house of Register House. <laughs> The Director's Awards are presented on Honors Day to a boy and girl from the senior class for their outstanding contributions to Darlington and for making a difference in the life of the school. This year's recipients are Lily Stott Washburn, Hickory, North Carolina, Elijah Rain Fricks, Plainville, Georgia.
The Betts Master Teacher Award is given in memory of the late Oscar Betts, class of 1919, who endowed the award. The recipient is selected by the head of school with the advice of the academic dean and the upper and pre-K to eight directors. Uh, and with the academic dean, well, there's no academic dean anymore, that's me. Um, <laughs> from candidates nominated by members of the graduating class. Uh, the Betts Award, therefore, is not only the gift of the school, but of the graduating class. It is symbolic of the graduates' appreciation for the many teachers who contributed to their learning and growth while students at Darlington. This year's recipient is John Cox. I would uh, first like to add my congratulations to all of the award winners today. We are proud of each of you and you should be proud of your accomplishments. They are a great testament to your efforts and hard work. I want to just uh, quickly mention uh, detail, not details, but information about the weather uh, and ceremonies uh, this evening and tomorrow. Uh, just so that we are as informed as we can be uh, leading into uh, the upcoming events. Uh, needless to say, uh, commencement on the lawn uh, at Darlington is a special event for our community. And we will monitor the weather throughout the afternoon and evening. And if, and only if, we feel the weather will impact the experience for our graduates and their families will we move the ceremony inside to the Van Ness Arena in the Huffman Center. Please note that if we make this decision, the official notification from the school will come through the texting system, then email and the school's website to communicate plans more in general should that be the case. We will make this decision as close to 7 a.m. tomorrow as possible. Please remember if, if the ceremony is moved inside, as per published information, it begins at 10.30 a.m. rather than 9.30 a.m. That gives us time to finalize preparation inside. Again, these details, if necessary, will be shared with you, seniors, class of 2018, pictures would be at 9 a.m. rather than at 8 a.m. if that is the case. Families, we will open the doors to the Huffman Center at 9.30 to begin the seating process. So this is not a definitive statement, obviously by any means, but we want you to know where to look and where to be aware should we need to make any different plans for the morning. This evening for baccalaureate, if it is raining during or after the ceremony, we will make the necessary adjustments uh, to stay as dry as possible. We're not gonna make you have a reception outside if it's raining, for example. So uh, excited for those events and obviously all thinking positively uh, about the weather uh, and our opportunities to be together uh, tonight and tomorrow. Today on Honors Day, or on All Honors Day, the thing that I am most reminded of is our need to be grateful. And our need to be grateful for all that we have and for all of those that make it possible. In 1974, Elson Floyd from Henderson, North Carolina became Darlington's first African-American graduate. I imagine that he sat in the chapel in a ceremony very similar to today's. Probably by this point in the ceremony he was getting a little antsy and ready for the next thing. 
As some of you might recall from the celebration of life service we held for Dr. Floyd here in the chapel in September of 2015, he went on to become one of higher education's most significant leaders through his ten years at, as president of Western Michigan, the University of Missouri system, and finally Washington State University. Upon receiving the Darlington School Distinguished Alumnus Award in 2004, Dr. Floyd stated, while there are many alums more deserving of this award, there is not a single one who is more grateful. I believe it is with that sense of gratitude that propels us towards a meaningful life. Today is one of those days where we truly drink from wells we did not dig. And so it is especially important to be grateful and to say thank you. Someone today for this ceremony who does not get enough thanks, but I would like to thank publicly for all the work and effort that she does to make this a special day is Mrs. Denise Evans. Let's give Ms. Evans a big round of applause. Like you, I sit and I hear the names read and the descriptions of the awards, and I'm reminded that we need to be thankful for the life and the legacy of people like A.J. Huffman, Anna Kipp, Hannah Tillman, and so many more who left their mark but also left us too soon. We need to be grateful for the generosity and sacrifice of the many families, like the Hanks family, the Smith family, and many more who helped sustain the school with their gifts and with their generosity. We need to be grateful for the faculty and the staff. We hear names like Gordon Neville and Randa Mixon, who helped to pave the way. And we need to be thankful for the energy and dedication of our current faculty and staff. Thank you for all that you do for us each and every day. And perhaps most importantly, we need you, our students, to know that we are thankful for you. We are proud of you, and we are grateful for the many, many contributions that you make to Darlington. Now recently, the Bell family watched the movie Wonder. Some of you have seen that movie. Some of you have read the book. And the main character in the book is Augie. And at one point in the story, Augie says, I think that there should be a rule that everyone in the world should get a standing ovation at least once in their lives. So what I'm going to ask you to do now is for everyone here to give each other a standing ovation. Thank you again for your time and attention today. Class of 2018, lead us out. <laughs>